something feels odd ah. here. Be on your guard. Could it perhaps be the three wild animals behind us ready? Oh, sorry, four. Four wild animals ready to pounce on us, though, Halim. Did you consider that? Welcome back to Gator Sniper playthrough of Tales of Arise, where, um... Yeah, I'm committed to the dungeon crawl now. I just finished editing the fucking last episode today. I was like, oh, yeah. This is apparently a big dungeon crawl. One that my friend told me is a very big dungeon crawl. Unless this isn't even the right dungeon. This could be the dungeon prior to the really big fucking dungeon crawl. There's only one way to really find out, I guess. I am going to actually try my damnedest to, like, you know, kind of kite these guys over here. Kind of, yeah, <laughs> you can't fucking beat me at my 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 one good skill set. Oh, fuck, there's a big praying mantis. But it's okay. The wolves will fight the praying mantis, and I will be a-okay. Why this episode's gonna be, like, fucking 20 minutes long? Because <laughs> I just skip over everything, and whatever I don't, I just wind up cutting out of the episode. Honestly, yeah, like, these types of episodes where it's just, like, you know, big-ass fucking dungeon, they tend to go that way, where it's like, yeah, uh, uh. Oh, I thought everything was, like, fucking still over there pissed at me. Yeah, no, these ones are as a dungeon crawl. There's, there's a lot of content that's gotta get cut out, so... Let's just, uh, get to that, I guess. God, I'm so good at kiting. You'd think I'd have, like, class in a video game about this. Oh, oh, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, fucking goddamn Alvin, please! Fucking jump-scaring me with his own fucking face, my lord. When are they gonna make the ultimate fucking weird, uh, like, fucking, I guess, cross- Not crossover game, but when are they gonna make a JRPG that's, like, really mixed with- Horror. Never mind, I'm starting to realize it's like everyone's fucking fan game that they made on uh, RPG Maker. Because I, I was thinking more of like... Honestly, no, even what I was thinking of has already been made. Sorry, I just never played those fucking games. I think you have things like uh, where it's like you get jump scared. <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, that's very much like all those fucking games that have been out. You got like fucking, uh, what, f Father's House? Doctor's... What is it? Mother's House? Father's House? I don't know, fuck it, that's, that's one of many, and I don't even know what the other many of them are. There's one of those games, there's, it's those games that, like, every fucking Let's Player from, like, 14 years ago was playing, and they're not bad. Um, I just, you know, never played them. Honestly, if anything, I'd appreciate their fucking aesthetic more. I love those, uh, games aesthetic. Actually, oh man, I don't remember if I've talked about it. I had to have talked about it. I, uh, speaking of that, like, I guess RPG style aesthetic, I've been playing a lot of Chain Echoes, which has been such a good, fucking refreshing, like, style of RPG. W wouldn't it be funny if I talked about the same thing in, like, a previous episode of Tales of Arise? But yeah, no, Chain Echoes is just so fucking good. I love it so much. It has been one of my favorite RPG experiences I've had in a very long time. It's just like, it's, it's, um, I, it's weird because I never even really played a lot of those types of games, uh, like those style of RPGs as a kid, but I'm still weirdly nostalgic for it. It's just like, I am more invested in the way, like, the, like, the, the world building and the way, like, the setting looks in those styles of games, it's just, it's just more interesting to me than, like, the cool CGI landscapes that can be made. Oh, not to say that, like, I mean, this game's had really good fucking, um, like, areas. I've been into it, too, but it's just so much, it's, it's more my style when it's like that. It's super cool. I, I recommend Chain Echoes 100%, even though I haven't finished it and I haven't played it in, in, a, in a few weeks at this point. Been really busy. I've had a lot of shit going on. I started a new job. It's hard to uh, have time for things. Ah! Ah! Hell yeah, brother. Fucking praying mantis can't beat me. Even though a praying mantis to that side is probably the most deadly thing on the fucking planet. Praying mantises are fucking scary. I hate how this has like been a thing I've brought up multiple times, but on an episode of Baki. <laughs> Um, I mean, they just, I don't know, the thing in Baki was stupid. Baki was like an image training where he's like, I'm going to fight this deadliest thing on the planet. And this little kid's like, what could it be? I bet he's got a magical triceratops or something. And then Baki's like, no, I'm going to fight a praying mantis. Um, but you know, it's actually like, you know, I, 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 I bet on the praying mantis. And it was kicking his ass for a little bit until, you know, it, it lost because, you know, it's, it's Baki. 
main character syndrome, he's always gonna win. Uh, that's how. It, actually, you know what? I'm, uh, I'm not gonna spoil or nothing or anything, but uh, that's actually not true. Baki doesn't win all the time. <laughs> um, actually, I don't think anybody cares about Baki spoilers, but um, I forget who it is. It's either fighting the fucking caveman that they're fucking resurrecting. Where it's fighting Musashi Miyamoto. Both of which you would be like, what the fuck are you talking about? This is a modern day, like, fight manga. And yeah, trust me, it happens. <laughs> These things happen when you live in the universe of Baki, where, where Yujiro Hanma can just punch out an entire army and be considered, like, a threat worse than a nuke. That's just how it is. Also, I see we've made it to a, uh, a nice looking area. We got anything uh, spooky going on here? I wish I bought this a new sword. It. Fuck. The entrance to the Forbidden Zone. Oh, oh yeah, that was our goal. Sorry, I but thought we were just, just going into the dungeon. Uh, how do we get through? You don't. This Whoa, is the we. Forbidden Zone. I thought this was Sovereign Zone. <laughs> Whoa, Rinwell, we we're not going anywhere. We're Danins. No. We're not allowed. He just got like hit with a full dose of the brainwashing. Oh, that's right. We have a Sovereign. Okay, cool. Yep. Just you know. Open up that door for us there, buddy. Go on now, just, you know, pop open that there door for us, and we'll just uh, sit pretty looking nice over here. Do your thing. He can do it at will now? Okay, cool. I was going to be like, it'd be funny if he didn't know how to activate it. Oh, cool. I was about to think, like, oh, access not granted, huh? Ooh. Yes! It opened! Wow, that was so interesting. interesting. This must be the, the uh... Presence still opens the way. Uh. It would seem the sovereign of three centuries. Yeah, the ago fucking computer now, doesn't give a shit. Computer probably didn't even think. Hello. Okay. What? Got the, what the the gold dust. Are we being uh, assimilated? Have we been brainwashed? Oh no, we're getting hit with the memories. Memories, memories, Alfred. memories. Oh, you bitch. You again. Oh damn. He basically did say Tomorrow's that. Tomorrow's the spirit channeling ceremony. Oh. We'll you don't sound anything like your great 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 dad granddaughter. How have you been feeling? Like shit, I've been kidnapping you, oh, son of a bitch. Shuffled from lab to lab, always treated like an experiment. Whenever they look at me, all they see is a Danon. I don't even know what Tell the me more. ceremonies Tell for. me more, Alfin. Let alone how you feel bad. Me to do as Let the me choose some more things in Tell your me, ear. If we're both in the same boat. Why do you seem so calm right now? Um, no choice. Mm. Becoming the maiden's not something I wanted Is for myself. Is it my headset? Or the but audio they, sounds weird. They said Rena's prosperity depended on it. It sounds like it's How could I say kind of clipping that? a little bit, Still, or like the gain is up. Good for you. Yeah. Meanwhile, I was taken from my homeland. Damn, Alpha was a lot angstier 300 right years ago. You, and I'm sorry for what it's wow, worth. Wow, a Renan that's not racist. When this is over. I swear happens I'll once every 300 years. I, I guess twice this, this year, uh, century. One more day. Oh. Uh, How could I say no to that? Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's like, not like I have any choice in the matter anyway. Stupid Shion lookalike. So, what's your name? And it's how do you Naori. pronounce it? Naori. Naori okay. Imaris. It's so. Try to remember this time. Why does it sound like that? Maybe it's just you my headset. Like them. I'll probably like listen to it and back and be like, no, that sounds fine. How come you treat me like a person? Um, because you are because one. You are. <laughs> okay. It's true we come <laughs> nice. from different worlds. Uh -huh. But neither one of us asked to be here right now. The only ones that we really look down on are the people same. from the third moon. They're like weird you little mole this. frog guys. We hate you those. They're definitely less than people. us. Alfin's like, if we didn't you know, if I was 300 years older, I would probably say something about that, but for now, I agree. So I suppose the question you should be asking is, mm -hmm. why wouldn't I treat you like one? Um, man, I wish I could ask that You're to your entire race. This. Maybe they're not like oh, me. Oh, this is also mo -capped. Yeah, I mean, Here's either we'll is do. correct. I mean, thank we'll you for your, your particular you fucking to Dana. particulars. the end of it. You're just like everyone else. Or sorry, you're not I'm like everyone else. Words. Maybe everyone else you're isn't like me. Right. Yeah, not okay. Them. Same fucking Naori. thing. Naori. Naori. Oh, Naori. I wish I could have been the voice for Alvin. Oh. Oh. What the hell just happened? I came. I hate it. I hate it so much. Did everyone else see it too? 
Yeah, why? Why did we all see it? Speaking to, she looked exactly I don't like know. I don't say that. It was Naori. Naori Imeris. Do you know, Isn't like, right? your own ancestry? Shouldn't you know that name? <sighs> yeah. I mean, right. we've only brought it up, like, fucking really five times. She really does look like Xion. I'm beginning to see why Alfin was so confused. Honest mistake, That's all I very know. very well and fine, but what did we just witness exactly? Mm -hmm. It was too real to be a mere hallucination. Um, it was a conversation we had 300 yeah, years fucking ago. Fucking computer system hacking into your brains. You mean all of that really happened? I bet all sovereigns just are just all goo in one past? fucking jar, one big coon jar, that even and they all share the same uh, thoughts, yes. memories, and feelings. Could this be the Red um, Woman's handiwork too? Just like an Evangelion. No, I don't think so. One big coon Why jar. Not? You guys didn't feel it? The moment the entrance opened, mm. it was like a stream of Dan and Sorry I'm eating, energy rushing uh, over us. trail mix, but I am I quite felt hungry. Too. Not for mm -hmm. the first time either. It was the same sensation as back inside the wedge. So just a bunch of Dan that and astral energy sense. trapped in here, After and all, you know the das, the Dan and uh, I don't know the planet, the planet of Dana. Are we no. like full on saying that the planet is like sentient or has feelings stored. at the very least? So you think it are the feelings the trapped up in here too? That was responsible for that vision we just saw. Good but question. how and why? Perhaps as no a very good it. clue Maybe or foreshadowing for what's about that. to happen. Hmm. Shion, you okay? That bitch. Yeah. I liked her hair more than mine. I'm gonna start copying her style once I get a new so outfit. That was my ancestor, huh? Mm -hmm. It was like looking into a mirror. I still disagree. Yeah, There's something the about Naori. I guess it is just the hair. Her eyes are different too, right? Naori's got like fucking me. At least grayer eyes. I don't know. Blander. I know they're not from. that blue. It's likely we'll see more of those. Oh God. Reliving painful episodes from this your past. This game already has Do you think you can soup, handle like it? too many cuts. I, I don't remember if I talked about it in the last episode because my editing process is very skimmy. Um, but my friend was, was telling me about it, like because I he is the one that's like super into tales of games. I was like. Tell him I'm like, oh That's yeah, I'm getting back in Tales of Games, and uh, he likes the. I, I'm trying to think of how we actually got into this conversation. We we're talking about like, uh, like I guess for the ranking of this game, I guess. He was like, he it's not it's not one of his favorites, um, be, particularly because they bombard you with so many fucking cutscenes. I was like, yeah, one hundred percent, I agree with you. Because it's like it, you walk five steps and you got five skits back to back that you don't have to watch, but they're kind of nice to see, and it's an RPG, so you're kind of like, well, you know, the, the people talking is kind of what I'm like into. It's a good thing the gameplay is. Uh, uh, all right, too. I've I'm personally never lost interest in the gameplay of this game. <laughs> Hello, hello, healing circle. What are we uh, what are we walking into? All right, but yeah, no, it's just like the fucking um, yeah, this is mysterious, ain't it? Yeah, no, it's just fucking um, just too many fucking cutscenes. Even like without the skits, there's too many like actual cutscenes happening like all the fucking time. But it's a big story heavy game. I mean, that's just how it is. Um, honestly, I feel like you just have to skip the skits, uh, and then, you know, like, maybe listen to it at campfire, but honestly, like, it's been more of a problem for my way of playing, because I do it as a recording. Oh, is this that one bitch? Hey, you're not a sovereign, what are you doing up here, lady? Oh, I guess she's been brainwashed. Faria, how did you get in here? I'm Wait, the sovereign. Something about her isn't right. She's got a fucking dead fish eye look. What's wrong with her? She doesn't oh. even seem to know where she is. Ah. Yeah, you're right. She looks just like the soldier. I'll give her a curb stomp outside. just for good measure. <laughs> okay, you can just have a dark astral core, huh? Okay, fine. Have one, I guess. Not like we should have had one. Or sorry, master core, not astral core. I'm like, asshole core. Whoa. Oh, what the fuck? You summoning the goddamn devil all of a sudden? The hell? It's pretty fucking sick. That's also that's like a that's fucking somebody? alien, right? But that's preposterous. Ah. She never had that kind of power. Wait, is summoning? Has su is it a Zugul and has summoning Zugul's been like a oh torment? Nice. It looks fucking cool. Oh, it is a Zugul. Okay, cool. That explains. I was really like, it just looks so different. I was like, is this a fucking alien? Because if I if what I was saying before becomes like if it happens, I'll be so fucking mad. I don't even know. <laughs> Not upset. Very surprised, I guess. Ooh, I'm getting so good at the dodges now. 
I've not practiced it at all. Usually I just don't dodge at all. But now I'm actually like, you know what? This is a function to game at. It's weird. There's like been literally like it wasn't even a conscious thought I had where it's like, I should dodge more. It's just like, hey, my finger's on the right trigger and I'm seeing this shit happening. I don't know, maybe I've I don't know. It's I guess from playing out in ring, I, maybe I don't know. I'm just actually doing like, you know, my job in this game, I guess. Blah, punch it in the butthole! Yeah! God, that would be fucking destructive. That that thing, if it has a butthole, it doesn't anymore. At least not a usable one. It's just, it's been decimated. Law, you're a terrible person. It's like the same thing as like, you don't punch somebody in the dick. You don't fucking just like, you know, jam your fist up someone's asshole aggressively. Non-consensually. Like, Law, come on, man. Oh, yeah! Yeah! Oh, wait, fuck, I'm gonna get blown up. Oh, never mind. It's just being stupid. This has not been the uh, scariest boss I've ever fought. <laughs> he's kind of, he's kind of just dicking around, I guess. I don't know. It's like I, I feel like he could be scarier as well. Damage isn't all there. I mean, I guess I've been dodging since. How about everyone else? Then? Shion's a little hurt. Not terrible. We're still in good healing range. Oh, we broke the core. Oh, fucking Avast! Holy shit! This is I. How do I fucking quit this? How do I make it never show up again? This happened in um, fucking Genshin Impact too when I was playing. It just fucking pops up and says like, oh, "Hey, we have some things to tell you." What do you have to tell me? Maintenance was last run January first at 5:22 p.m. One problem has been found. You don't need to fucking minimize all my tasks for this bullshit. I I I'm so mad. I have never just been this like zero to a hundred mad before it's just so infuriating what fucking program do you ever make that's not like a security program or something to do with like vital importance with like things of monetary value or health and safety do you have that's just like i'm gonna minimize whatever programs right in front of you it's so fucking infuriating. What if I was playing League of Legends? Do you think I can pause League of Legends? What the fuck? Avast is definitely not the fucking uh, gamer software. So yeah, take that. Uh, all right, well, I'm done having my hissy fit. So uh, back to fighting the big boss. I sure hope it doesn't have any second form that's gonna start one-shotting me with every hit. That would be the worst. Uh, can someone fucking fix Shion? Why is no one fixing Shion? She's been dying for like years. Oh, it hurt the shit out of me. Oh my god. Oh, it worked! Hell yeah, I'm so glad I managed to hit that in time. That was really cool. Now I gotta go heal, so you guys, uh, you guys tank. Oh my god! Oh, there goes Rinwell. Oh! It's okay, we didn't even make it in time. She'll, she'll get up. She's fine. She's Oh, you know what? I, you know what? This is probably very important. Uh, one of the rare things happened. Uh, somebody left a comment, and they said, uh, did you know you can switch your characters out in battle? They're specifically like, I don't know if you have episodes and backs, or I don't know if they said it like that, but they're like, I don't know if you already know this, but you can switch characters. And they told me how to do it, and I was like, oh, fuck yeah, that's awesome. And now I don't know how to do it. Can I just, like, you? Well, this is just switching who I'm playing as. Fuck! If only I fucking listen to what they, what they had. Is that under strategy? No? Wait, hold on, hold on. Change tactics? No. No, this is not. Fuck! If only I'd paid attention to what they had said. Um, I don't know. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna keep going with what I'm at. And uh, ooh, we're out of actually. Ah, fuck! I don't have any time to cast an item. We are all out of CP, and that's fucking terrifying. <laughs> oh, she on you, or Runwell, You just died. Why did you die again? It's okay. It's okay. We got. This. We got. This. Sorry, one random commenter. I am stupid, and I did not look at how to actually switch characters. I, as in, I looked like three weeks ago when I saw the comment, and now I have no fucking remembrance of how to do it. Also, what was your deal, lady? I hope your head explodes. Yeah, let's fucking drop kicker. Can you hear me, Faria? 
Uh, it's okay. You could say she's far away from here. <laughs> Are you kidding me? The art she's casting is no way fucking too way. To control. Do I actually this have way. to fight another her one of those fucking things? Can we just, like, hit her? Yeah, Dolene. Crack her across the fucking skull. Or we could have just done that, I guess. Forgive me. Oh, <laughs> you know Dohalim took great pleasure in that. We could have just shot it from the get-go, I think. All right, all right, it's all good. How Man, you? I thought we were goners. That one actually kind of did okay? start kicking my yes. ass towards the end. She's only unconscious. You don't her. knock people you. unconscious with a gut punch. I'd like to add. Then again, maybe the Shion, astral please. energy. Can you treat her? her out? No. I can try, but. I can't promise she'll be back to oh, her real oh, self yeah, once she true. wakes up. All Fuck. I can do is heal her physically. If only we didn't care so greatly about We're this new NPC. Here. Maybe it'd be better if we moved her to somewhere a little safer. Don't I you think? I feel like she's probably safe out case, here. I'll take her off your hands. I'm sorry. You? Avakir. You've what been you following us too? What the fuck? I'm curious what you were up to. So I took the liberty of following you. You are out. so I overheard what you said contrived about right now, okay? About how really died. Oh. I'm sorry. I had no idea. You really and did you just me? happen you to so come sure here out of all coincidence. I, like I know you a little better than that, Doe Helene. Give me oh, some. We're playing the music. That's so fucking sweet, <laughs> though. Despite how convenient this all is. Leave her with me. Don't worry. I'll tell her how you killed her brother, it but it was because he was a piece of shit. It's like, no! Thank you. Damn it! We don't want that to happen. Well, all right. Guess she'll be uh, back in. Uh, okay. Now that okay, never mind. I thought we were about to. He hasn't changed. I don't know. He never was one. This is one of those things where, like, if this whole thing was cut out, I could see it working good for skit or cutting down on skits. But then again, like, I don't know. It's a big, important character thing for Dolhalim, so it's like, I don't know. That's probably something they had to really fucking, um... Oh, yeah. That's something they probably really had to fucking worry about, like, when it came to the final steps of this game, where it's like, what do if we need to me. cut out uh what can we cut You're out wrong. what do we have to keep them like be really fucking important for the uh Under orders the characters like arcs as for Tarnigan, it's like yeah if it weren't I mean, for the crown contest I, he'd still I don't be know alive. i think i th that i think i know how to talk i think they could have but that's why locked a lot not to locked but i think they could have hidden a lot more skits behind like set like preconditional things where it's like you kind of have to be in these areas that's the wackest fucking thing when i was playing tales of Fantasia for the first time was how um there are skits in that game but you have to fucking to stumble upon them to dead. see them I was like that's fucking no cool amount of soul searching I like that to make amends instead of just like that. I'm sure there are some in this game where it's like they're kind of hidden behind like Those ships like have event sailed. time so yeah event timers I guess I, I don't know Sorry, no, they're talking about something important. Fact. I'm talking about, like, you fucking remember. events. But uh, I'm just saying, there's too many you that you can just in walk into, always. and they're right there. And then you go on living. Yeah. Never forget. Not for those already passed, but for those still alive. Kisara's told those still alive. Never mind. I was about Kisara's to say right. a joke. I don't so know if it's something that would be in our bodies, cool to joke we can about. Make a difference in the lives I don't know. Is it okay to joke about, like, the never forget part of 9-11, but not the actual Being part of 9-11. Oh, God. Punishing yourself for the past won't mm -hmm. make the pain of your conscience go away. Yeah. Only fixing the problem in its stead. Is that what you're saying? I mean, the That's problem's right. already fixed itself. He already killed the guy. You have to live for tomorrow, Dohalim. Yeah. Not for yesterday. And not only that, you need to live for yourself. And for the change that you still can Sorry be. if I ask this, but have we gained anything I from this try. conversation? Don't forget, it's we've like, still got a mystery to solve. I don't know. The, forbidden the whole zone, thing is like... Shion. He's like, oh man, I killed my best friend because he was kind of a shithead. I can't tell Fari about it. For what you did for and it's like... Kisara had the whole talk with him where it's like, never forget the things and move on. And peace and everything. It's like, okay. Has literally nothing about all of that situation changed? Shucks. Because maybe, team, right? I don't know. Let's All that's changed is that now he feels better about it. Literally nothing else has had from that conversation has, like, mattered. Because Faria is probably not going to find out Do you still. Think Faria I don't was know. Really being controlled by someone? Um, yeah, I guess. Certainly mm. seen that way. The question is, who? 
The Maybe she was just high. The same person who's and no one was controlling her. She just had her own actions to blame. Brainwashed or otherwise. She ate some of that the fucking of weird flower that uh, gets real. people crazy high. Used her I don't know if I've ever talked back. about that. And I also don't know. If, no, I think I did because I remember talking about this, and I think giving like a very good Someone warning about it. Um, Someone who means but, us harm. I don't know. There There's is no a flower at uh, where I'd gone to college uh, at that apparently people can them like, like a eat and it gets some we need to find like whoever it is not fast. good high it gets some fucked up high where like you, you don't feel pain and you do really stupid fucking things um, and in the story I'd heard was like people like were caught like mutilating their own bodies because they're like I can't feel anything isn't that wacky and then yeah they just completely fucked up their uh, their bodies irreparably um, and I'm pretty sure I've I don't know I've probably mentioned where I had gone to college before but I will not for right now uh, because in case someone her fucking was like I'm going to find that college and their funny flower um, I mean it is just a Terror. You don't even. You're not gonna die from it. You're just gonna fuck up your body irreparably. Anyways, meanwhile, back in the the land of non-drug use, I don't know. Have we had drug use in this game? I'm trying to remember. Anything drug-related happen? Do you hear something again? I hear your fucking attitude. Yeah. And a delicious crunch of it's a sesame stick. Oh, why can't I hear the, the will voice? Of Dennis astral energy. Am I like? Uh, uh, not allowed to hear the voice of the planet because I'm a player. I'm not from either Rena or Dana. I like it when games do that kind of shit, though. Where it's like they kind of... Oh, gross. We had a weird flesh room that we were in back in the day. I hate it. Oh. The Rhenish Alma. Why are there flesh rooms? Why do we make these? Are Zugos going to be way more important than we realized? Oh, God. I mean, they're probably made from, like, the primordial ooze. Oh. What? There's so much astral energy. Yeah. But where's it all coming from? It's almost like it's oh. alive. Kind of spooky. Was this... This is on Lenigus? <laughs> yeah, it had to be on Lenigus. What's the... Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, I don't like that. Oh, bro, there's something so icky about that. Ooh, we got spooky eyes. Damn. No wonder Shion's so upset all the time. If I had something like that in me, with spooky ass eyes. Oh. So, what did some. Oh, so she's the one that caused the fucking big accident to happen. Not that. And Alfin's just like, oh, everything's probably okay. Or has time paused? I don't know. This is so weird looking in the these fucking graphics. Because it doesn't look, give the feeling of time being paused. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, jeez. Oh. Jeez. <laughs> Wait, so did he kind of, like, ah, oh, find everything out in time? I was just like, I don't know, the darkness looked like it got into him, Kingdom Hearts style. But was that, like, the setup? Why there's a Maiden and a Sovereign? Does the Sovereign kind of, like, deal with the Maiden's, like, icky, dark power? And that kind of, like, tamps it down that for a little bit? That was the spirit channeling ceremony just now. Mm -hmm. No, it was more than that. It was another sesame stick. What the hell With good was crunch. That? It felt like everything was on the mm -hmm. brink of... Like the whole world was... She owns it. Now you know how I feel all the fucking time. Oh, Is that what it's we're gonna call It's the same vision them? as the one my thorns show me. Mm. A vision of impenetrable darkness that swallows up This is not where I thought this else. game was gonna go. <laughs> An empty void. Mm -hmm. A nothing so complete and dominating that there aren't even words to describe it. Wait, is it like the hollow? The of time. Like how people are hollowed and they turn into the you, what you call nothing? If I'd known how bad, they, know were, how bad I... they were, I would have said we should have quit forever ago. Uh, now question. What if they launched so, Xion deep into space? Saw, 
Those were Naomi's What if she is far right? away from all right. of the planets? It was as if her innermost thoughts know. were speaking directly God, to it's us. It's kind of like, because I think she had said before, like, mine. what was in her was going to destroy literally everything. And I was kind of like, wow, well, yeah, like the planets in the vicinity, like Rena and Dana, but I don't know. What's responsible for maybe all it is, like, she's been everything. Then maybe, no matter how deep you throw into space, made from nothing that will same happen. Astral energy. Yeah. If that is Don't the case, quit eating sesame just sticks. Found ah, a missing sorry. Link between your thorns and what happened here three centuries ago. Mm -hmm. No, more than a link. Perhaps even the very heart of the matter. Yes. Big spooky so fucking powerful. thing in your what was that? body. Yeah, actually. If it's the same energy your thorns are made of, yeah. it must be dark astral energy, right? And what if it's the spirit of Rena? Correct. And dark maybe it's really mad. <laughs> Hmm. That is weird. And when enough astral energy gathers together, it develops its own form um, of sentience. Like if so, fire one. Maybe that or the other one that I guess exactly I'll never see. what the Renan astral energy's will is wishing for. But why? Um, maybe it doesn't like people. I don't know. Will Seems like everybody has been kind of down. abusing astral it's energy. So, if it's, it's like the, the will fucking will of the planet. And the will of I don't know, it seems like Rena would be pretty pissed off right? if, like, all of and its juice had been, been drained. But then why is it all sealed know, up in, like, really so the Emeris family? Would never want oblivion. But you can't say Dana's sure. will is probably like, hey, I want to help out my bro, over Rena. Will get us nowhere. By squabbling <sighs> over these delicious salted almonds. Mm. Let's keep moving. Delicious. If it's Dana's will I just do a bit memories, out of it so I give myself an excuse to chew on trail us. mix. But if it could lead us to the truth, then I want to find out more. Mm-hmm. Shion's right. All we can do is keep going. Yeah. Otherwise, this game will never. Memories, <laughs> memories we're watching. There could be truths in them I was never aware of. Hmm. Maybe and you should pay attention the first time, the Alpha. Kinds of truths I need to Fucking asshole, not like your memories fighting. got sealed away for 300 years and are kind of coincidentally I'm coming back what I said at earlier. convenient Come times. On, let's go. Wait, what did you say again? All I remember him getting Finally, yelled at for is calling Dana's will shit. Yes, and their source. I, I kind of had a skit. I guess I was talking about skipping the skits all this time, it. but um, yeah, I'm just walking. Did I... Okay, good. It was for a cutscene. I was like, did I really need to um, watch a cutscene so, walking? I very well learned the oh. truth behind Shion's thorns. Oh. As well as my own past. Oh, yeah? I have to be ready to face anything. Oh. Whatever happens. Like, I should... Oh, God, I'm kind of low on items, aren't I? Uh... Oh, man, yeah, I kind of am low on items. Where do I even buy Just items it. from here? Can I also fast travel here? That's my next question. Um, fuck, man. If I can, I'll be really mad. Fuck. This is where... Yeah. That's... That's not good enough. The game really makes me never want to fucking use, like, these moments to actually resupply. Because then I'd have to walk through all this all over again. It's like, that is that is not worth it in my eyes. Oh, seeing visions, though. Let's see what this is about. That vision we saw. Mm -hmm. It was as if it was meant specifically for us. D the will of Dana is really like, come on, you guys, it? get it already. I'm you trying to give you the, the answers. Dana might be involved somehow? But in a good way. Maybe it's trying to tell us something. That or Dana really hates well, the Renan be supernatural. Like, planet you know, like and energy. Seeing dead people, messages from beyond the grave. Ghost type stuff? Shut up, Law. Th there's a. <laughs> actually, there's a scientific oh, explanation for everything, boys. Law. Now go back to he believing in elemental shamanism like Rinwell told us, and she's what just doing a dance with like a fucking rain stick. Would have somehow become indelibly etched into the ether of a place. So now we're just and talking about with ghosts. a connection could then somehow pick up on them. God. You think it. that's what it was? Some kind of message? Oh, so he, left okay. I thought he was kind of like joking around, going with ghost stuff. Whether it was Dana's will, mm -hmm. or somehow connected to the sovereign and I always like powers. the idea of like events know. being so okay, fucking important and powerful that they that just get like etched in time. Energy, it can somehow show us events that happened centuries yes, ago. Yes, I believe that is what the writers made to give us a convenient like tie into the past. Seems unlikely it happened naturally. 
whatever it was. Probably it survived here the same fucking bullshit. It looked like years. Shion and Alfin were standing in another wedge. The strength of their intent or, is beyond doubt. I mean, I don't know. It looks the like strength of their intent. Mm. All right, cool story. Am I 43, 44 minutes? Okay. Um, fuck. Let's let's go in. Let's see what we got. If I have to listen to Alfin talk about that shit again. God damn it, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The only way is forward. Yeah. Hopefully we'll be able to pick up some healing items ahead. I know I should at least have a fucking go- Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, that's so stupid. That, that fucking dialogue where it's like, either yes to go forward or no to go back. And then it's like, no matter what I say, I'm able to fucking run free. If anything, I should have said to go forward in the first place, because now I don't have to deal with the little cutscene every time I go over here. That's just, it's its mildly infuriating. That's it. I just want to be loud about it. That still just does seem stupid, though. Mm -hmm. Oh, are we in a dungeon again? Oh, this isn't so bad. Hmm. Okay, okay. Go forward and see what's uh, going on down here. Hold up, you guys. Oh. What is it? I've never been hit I with this many. Oh. Oh, this is that room I was in when I was um first looking. Past, yeah. Right? Wait, how'd you know that? Sure. I guess I told it everybody it in explicit detail. Okay. This has been the most times I've been like stopped by Alfin walking on his this own in this looks game. Looks like some kind of research facility. Yeah. With plants and jars. A laboratory secreted away in the forbidden mm -hmm. zone. Why am I past being surprised at this point? Because at this point, we're just being hit with so many, deserted. like, oh my god, but actually, look Let's at this, it and it's like, okay, it might give us a new lead. done enough. I'm no longer impressed. You're gonna have to really fucking surprise me now for something, uh, cr crazy. Okay, the Forbidden Zone, come on, guys. The people of Lenigus. What do you want to talk about? The Forbidden Zone is the stuff of dreams. Mm -hmm. Yet here I am, standing within its hallowed And halls. I'm not impressed. It's pretty lame, pretty mid, mid actually. Talk about an exclusive club. Yeah, you had to be sovereign Being exclusive to get here. is one thing, but how many important facilities let in only the sovereign? Mm. Doesn't that seem a little strange? It'd be that strange way Strange doesn't cover it. Whenever it a normal one, sovereign maybe. came through here, did they also have, like, free leeway to, like, go wherever the fuck they wanted, or did something, like, escort the them to is. wherever they had to they go? Manage the upkeep of this whole place themselves. Unless they did were a supercomputer. Mm -hmm. No, not that I can remember. Then again, uh. sovereigns and forbidden zones... And it wasn't like I actually had a breakfast table. Shion was, like, what, raised in a lab exclusively? We haven't really talked about that. I think we talked a little bit about it, but we haven't really, like... I don't know, because she she's of the Imeris family. We don't know what happened to the Imeris family. Imeris? Imeris? I don't know. But now, it is finally time to discover this area's true purpose. And why it was kept hidden behind the scenes for so long. Because a supercomputer told uh, somebody that, you know what, you didn't deserve the information. What's this table? Aha, uh -huh. they never came back from operations on this. That's a nice looking table, though. Kind of overly detailed, and with all the fucking, like, edges you got on that, or is that an embossment? I don't know. It's just like blood will get stuck in that. It'll be very hard to clean. But let's hack into this computer, see what we got. Got that fucking tri screen mm. setup. Can play I think Fortnite I can on this. And he just starts playing fucking Fortnite. I love that all their tech is just like my eyes glow and it just does whatever I want. Very convenient. Well, can you make head or tail of it? No, it's just a bunch of squiggly lines. These are experiment records by the looks of it. Reams of them mm. dating back hundreds of years. Let's see. Yeah, let's hear about Alfin. A composite being capable of controlling Dan and Astral energy. Oh. So as to convert its molecular and elemental makeup. Uh? The creation of a governing central figure taking the form of a but Danon. Why? Was Code it just compatibility? Sovereign. Oh. Code name. That means it's not actually, like, important. Wait, there's it's more. Just pro project. Him to utilizing force field crystals for the purpose of stable astral energy containment. Oh. Uh -huh. That must be the master cores. Oh, uh, th those are crystals? I thought they were just fucking, you know, With all this raw metal data, There's bound balls. to be records here somewhere about the Maiden and the Lords, too. Yeah, what's their whole fucking deal? I want to hear. About the Lords? Why would they be on there? Well, where the fuck else would they be, Kisar? <laughs> the Lords' crests are clearly of a piece with those of both the Sovereign and the Maiden. 
Uh, I'm trying to remember the, the crest that the now. Contenders to the Ball crown Staffs was a little otherwise regular Renan specific, citizens. wasn't it? Didn't it have like a in skull words, in it or something? It maybe that all Renans are unwittingly being made subject to some kind of grand scheme. Mm, what about the, the sovereign? Government. Does it say anything else? Hmm. Where do I start? All I've read so far is the headlines. There's so much here. To sift yeah. through all of it would require specialized... Wait, I'll put it in Excel. Did Control F. It's a list of names. Uh huh. With the title test subjects, sovereign. Alpha. It's your call. Oh. Um. Read it. Okay, I was like, I guess the... there must be dozens of test uh. subjects listed here, hundreds even. Oh. All of them failures. Will Wait. we finally find out Alfin's last name? Did successful. we? No, Danons don't have last names. That's right. Test subject uh -huh. number one two seven three. Oh. Ethnicity N A. Oh. Unique adjustment index. Can't generation, possibly be an Alphan. Given name. Four. Oh, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Gah! I have no ethnicity? What the fuck? That or it's Varenin's being the really petty. Me. Uh, what? Right here in this lab. Oh, okay, to be uh, sovereign, that's what. Oh, I guess. Unless he was made. I, I'm kind of lost now. <laughs> it's fine, really. What about the others? What do you mean by re-engineered? Sorry, I, I, I kind of lost that there. Test subject number one zero one zero five. Also, ethnicity, no ethnicity. NA. Unique adjustment index generation NA. Hmm. Given name. Volron. Volron. Whoa, the only two Volron? to make it. But that means. Was he also three hundred years? No, she is only sovereign because someone yeah. made him that way too. Hmm. He's so. the last one. In three centuries Damn. worth of records, you and Volron so are the only two subjects on whom the experiment that win the contest are just what like fucking for shits and giggles. <laughs> I don't know. It's so weird. If they have to like, if they went through that much effort to only physically like the make, the crown yeah. Does this mean that none of them exactly. were ever crowned sovereign after all? Mm. Upon victory, the sovereign shall return to Rena. And rule over mm -hmm. Rena and Lenigus combined. That's it. That's all. When a new says. sovereign is decided, the outgoing oh, okay. monarch That's... shall relinquish their okay. post. And oh no! The rest of their days on Rena. At least that answer is what so happened we to old sovereigns. But according to these records, there have only ever been two sovereigns, neither of whom had anything to do with the crown contest. All the other sovereigns are sacrifices. That's lies, my guess, including the part about the sovereign residing in Rena. Damn, I really wanted that the crown fucking contest nice never about country home. A new ruler. That's what all the Renans must get, or the Sovereigns got. For some other purpose. Ooh. The music is really helping carry the scene here. It's that's real fucking true. spooky. Someone must have been in charge for the past three centuries, right? Mm. If it wasn't the Sovereign, then who was it? Mm. Crown contests have been held this whole time. In spite of the fact that there was already a sovereign, and I didn't even get to fucking tell people what to do. What the fuck? Years, someone out there has to have been maintaining that lie. The same person I'm willing to bet is behind all this. You say same person like someone lived for three hundred fucking. Woman? Oh, never mind. I guess the red woman is a good guess. It's possible, but that doesn't necessarily mean she's the mastermind behind this. She's scene. like the equivalent of Clippy. She's just there she as like administrative aid. Else. Someone back on the Renan homeworld. There is no Renan homeworld. It's all shit. Either way, it's fair to say she's definitely involved somehow. Mm. What about the data records? Is there no other information that could help us? Yeah, honestly, there's gotta be Not so much see. info. Oh. Just file upon file of experiments. That's also results. true. From working in a place now there's that has like these types of computers set up, where it's like there's computers in each room for the different experiments, it probably only has information relevant I've to the experiments. To scratch the surface, mind you. You won't be able yeah, to read through it all. The like bureaucratic paperwork side of it must have been fucking can. awful. Here. No, I think that's okay. <laughs> Unless I could read more about like do I don't that. know, Alfin and Falrun in particular. Oh, man. I mean, I'm close enough to the so end this of the is where episode. Alfin oh, never mind, I guess. Although, um, well. I'll have the this skit for next time. Would suggest. Hey, so. it looks like the terminals in here turned oh. on, too. Oh, yeah, we should look right. through them. Oh. They might contain valuable information. Is that actually my objective? No, it's not. Okay. Let's well, uh, select a topic to explore. Ooh, actually, shit, this is curious. 
uh, master cores. Instruments of power containing astral energy along with six elements. Uh, elements, earth, wind, fire. Loan to Renan Lords. Only dark master cores maintained inside the Forbidden Zone to the Alma is ready to be reformed. Exists kept toxic secret. Uh, spherical outer layer is a force field crystal used for the purpose of astral energy containment and stabilization. Sort of dormant state. You should amass a lot of type of astral energy. Uh, they can uh, uh, withdraw their energy if they need it. Determined based on their own strength. Addendum. Design flaws have been discovered in how the Renaissance Alma materializes. Um, okay. Oh. Uh, master cores may resonate with other master cores located in close proximity, become unstable. There is successful regeneration of the master core. Master cores will cease to be deployed, and the crown contest will be permanently halted. Hey, it ain't happen at all. That's weird. Okay. What's a spirit core? Our end terminals used for the collection. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's a big thing in the uh, thing. Oh. Oh yeah. The, yeah. The little ones that are in their hands. Okay. Cool. Um. All right. Cool. So yeah, that just uh, sucks out the goo. Cool. Cool. Uh, they reuse after death. Oh, how? How? Um. What's the word I'm looking for? Recycling. <laughs> Recyclable. <laughs> uh huh. Increased physical load on host body tends to produce increased astral energy. Um. Hmm. Ah, death is what makes the most. All right, ah, that's that's neat. That was cool. Got some info. Uh, let's see what oh, oh, information is. Oh, there's fucking more terminals back there. Okay, well, we got lords. Unique adjustment index. Uh, that's a big thing. What's going on here? Okay, the following is a report on the second successful case of sovereign test subject experimentation. Uh, Voron, yes. Is, oh, this is just what we already... Oh, no, no, no. Here it is. Here it is. Although subject possesses high latent potential, it exhibits significant mental instability along with a strong distaste for following orders. As such, for risk it poses surpass though, even those of last successful subject. Itself a failure. It is therefore under consideration for disposal. Addendum. This is the first successful case of 300 years. Previously mentioned risk factors are now mitigated due to established control protocols. Man, this is like, there's still people working in here, and Ballrun was like, re recent, right? Man, who the fuck? Subject is to be evaluated under the assumption that plan to proceed and will be dispatched to Dan under the guise of serving as a lord. They didn't serve as a lord. Uh, okay, Beth 5 is qualified during their tenure, they grant 3, level 3 authority. Uh-huh. Okay, okay, they're assigned an ID crest. Only on astral artistry and physical mental aptitude. Uh, age has no bearing. Only the strongest go on to become lords. So the position itself does not inherently make a lord stronger. Uh, lords are not the only individuals capable of drawing out a master's power. Yeah, we've done that. Renans must take part in the succession process. Uh, Seventh position is mandatory. Oh, yeah, you can't even fucking say no to being a lord. Furthermore, in the event that an actual lord is incapacitated and can no longer serve in their place, replacement must be quickly prepared. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, just real quickly, what's in here? Sovereign made. Ah, oh, fuck! There's so much info! Okay, Sovereign made, and then that's gonna be it. That'll be it for the fucking episode. The Sovereign acts as Lenny's central control device for spirit channeling ceremony. Each one's granted level 2 authority. Oh, wait. I guess level 2 is probably higher than 1. I was thinking that, like, the bigger number is more powerful. Uh, ID Crest. A Dan and subject serves as base of its creation. In theory, ideal candidates possess equal affinity for every astral influence. However, such aptitude is statistically rare to uncover within real-world conditions. As a result, most subjects die during the adjustment period, and stability is still not guaranteed for those who survive it. Instability, coupled with the Sovereign's power of astral manipulation, poses a high risk to the security of Lenius if left unchecked. As such, stabilization measures must be put in place via the support mechanism when utilizing the Sovereign the Spirit Channeling Ceremony. Addendum 1. No effective alternate methods to perform the ceremony have been found. Trials on damn subjects are authorized to continue. Damn. Unit 2 uh, adjustments are a success. Subsequent uh, adjustments are to be put on hold while extended observations take place. Cool. Maiden. Real quick. Maiden acts as a sovereign support mechanism for the spirit channeling ceremony. Each one is granted level 2 authority and ID crest. Uh, Serves fine providing a sovereign with supplemental dark astral due to its lack of tan with the Renaissance Alma. During the ceremony, it is partly responsible for astral energy conversions while maintaining stability over your sovereign's own powers. Additionally, the degree of intimacy between it and the sovereign has been observed to positively impact the level of spit stability in both subjects. Because of this, trial activations of the sovereign without the maid present are expressly forbidden. Furthermore, ne neither the sovereign nor the maiden are to be informed about the details of the spirit channeling plan. Dem 1, mental instability in the maiden has been deemed the cause of the past sovereign's rampancy. Countermeasures must be considered. No, no. Dem 2, in line with the plan adjustments, the current subject will have its maiden registration revoked and be returned to its original household. Oh, so they returned, um, what's her face, Naori, back to uh, wherever she came from. But 
I I don't know. Like I, like I said, I don't know what the fuck happened to the Ameris family. It's weird. Um, I don't know, man. It's fucking wacky. All right. Well, there's two more terminals that I'll read next time I fucking record. So I'm just going to end this one here with a skit to deal with as well. So, yeah. This has been Gator Sniper Playthrough. See you guys in the next one. Later, everybody.